What's going on, gentlemen? It's Jesse here, and I'm about to tell you the three things that you should never tolerate from a woman. If a woman does any of these three things, then you are out the door immediately. These are three things that a girl does that we just do not stick around for. If a girl does any of these three things, it is over instantly. If a girl does these three things, you are like the Kool-Aid man running through the wall to get away. So the first thing you should never tolerate from a woman, guys, is look, I like peaceful women. I like women who don't bring no stress into my life because I am busy. I'm publishing videos for you guys. I'm here on the phone doing coaching calls. I gotta stay in shape. I gotta go out there, practice what I'm preaching. I'm a busy, busy bee, and I can't deal with no stress-inducing women. I simply do not have time for that. Look, life as a man is difficult enough as it is. You've gotta go out there in the world and compete and make something of yourself. You're already dealing with guys that are out there 12 hours a day, seven days a week working on themselves, working on their money game, working on their looks maxing game, working on their social charisma. You gotta go out there in the world and compete with rich dudes, with good looking dudes, with guys that literally spend hours a day talking to women. You're dealing and competing with ambitious men. You're dealing and competing with men that are sharks. So life is already difficult enough as a man as it is. And you don't need a difficult, combative woman in your life. But some of these women, they just like to poke you. They like to poke and poke and poke at a man. They like to cause chaos in his life. They like to poke around and look for your weaknesses, looking for the little chinks in the armor that they can exploit. Some of these women out there, they're just very combative. They're always challenging who you are as a person. They're challenging your authority as a man, and they're constantly trying to get a reaction out of you. And you're just gonna accept that drain on your energy, that drain on your time, that drain on your soul from a woman like that? Hell no, man. And you can tell right away with some of these women. Some of these girls, they just love play fighting. I mean, they just love to play fight. That's what gets her excited, where you poke her and she pokes you right back twice as hard and then some. And some of these girls, what they'll do is they'll keep shit testing you. She'll shit test you on the first date, then she'll shit test you on week one of the relationship, keep shit testing you into week two, into week three. They're constantly being combative. They love shit testing you. They love play fighting. So that first thing that you should never tolerate from a woman, guys, is a woman that's always testing your manhood. A woman that is combative. A woman that's challenging your authority and who you are as a person. Trying to poke around, find little chinks in the armor, looking for your weaknesses, poking fun at little things you do, trying to get an emotional response out of you. You know that woman that takes being strong and independent as I'm going to be combative with a man. And here's the problem with these girls. The moment that you react to her, the moment that you show her that you're gonna deal with it, her eyes just light up. She's like, ah, I got him to react. I got that emotional response from him. I caused the drama, I got the chaos. And what happens with these difficult combative girls over time is that they just end up with loser guys that have no other options. Sure girl, that guy, he's gonna let you walk all over him. Sure girl, he's gonna let you push him around. He's gonna let you cause all the drama and the chaos because that man that you're with has no other options. He is pussy struck. He is stuck with you because you are his only option. So stay away from these girls, gentlemen. Let these girls go find those beta fools that they can walk all over and let's find ourselves sweet, feminine, nurturing women. The second behavior you should never tolerate from a woman is if she's threatening to leave you. If a woman is threatening to leave you, it should just be like, all right, adios, goodbye. I'll see you later, alligator. You can go pack your bags right now. You know, if a girl threatens to leave you, it means she feels like she can replace you. It means she feels like there's other guys out there that are better options for her than you. And my thought process on this is, is heck, girl, there's not a lot of men out there like me. Very few, tall, good looking, ambitious, and heck, I can meet another girl like that. 
I can meet another girl like that. Female beauty is everywhere. Female beauty is very common. But a guy like me, that's one of a kind. A guy like me, that is rare. So you wanna go? Well, you can pack your bag, sweetheart, and you can go. Adios, sayonara. So if a girl ever threatens to leave you, all right, pack your bag, sweetheart. This, what we got between you and me, it's over, and that's fine with me. You wanna threaten to leave me? Look, I can replace you too. I'm good over here. I got other options, and you're not doing me any favors by staying. You can go find your beta male, that beta male who's gonna let you walk all over him. And guys, when you have this attitude, paradoxically, the girl knows, she knows that if she even tries you, she will lose you. So girls will not even try. Now guys, unless you know how to meet girls and turn those girls into fun dates and turn those fun dates into motivated girlfriends, then I got some bad news for you. Your girl, she is going to constantly test your manhood. She is going to cause drama and she's going to eventually throw threatened to leave you because she senses your weakness and she knows that she's irreplaceable. She knows that you're just going to let it slide every single time because you have no other options. That's why you need to learn how to meet more girls. You need to learn how to turn those girls into fun dates and get them into bed so that you have more options. And as long as you're lacking these girl getting skills, whatever girlfriend you have, she's gonna start acting up eventually and start to make your life miserable for you. So go to attractionzilla.com. You're gonna find another free video there for you to watch that's gonna show you how to apply for coaching with me Jesse, where I help guys like yourself get a beautiful, sweet, loyal, and loving girlfriend in just a couple of months, especially if you're an older guy who's just used to getting rejected, ghosted, and friend zoned with women. We can change all of that for you. Number three, the third thing you should never have to tolerate from a woman is drama. Look, a woman should be minimum drama and bring peace into your life. Because as a man, we already talked about this, your life is difficult. You've got a lot of pressure on your shoulders. And unlike a woman, you don't have intrinsic value. Your only value is what you build through your life. And as a successful man, life can get very difficult. Life can be very stressful because you're out there solving problems. You're trying to be the best man you can be, staying in shape, giving value, meeting women, conquering the world, running toward the stress, running toward the problems chasing after difficult and challenging goals. So a woman should be someone to come home to and relax to. That's her essential role, to help put you at ease as a man, to help recharge your energy with her femininity. And if she's an additional headache on top of everything else, if she likes to make the drama, if she likes to pile on the problems and does nothing to solve the problems herself, she has got to go because I'm sure as hell not gonna be dealing with no stress from no girl. A girl needs to be bringing peace into my life because as a busy man who's out there conquering the world, that guy is not gonna deal with no extra problems from some girl. And if a woman feels like she can just pile on the problems, pile on the drama and get away with it, that means she senses that you don't have any options, that you're gonna put up with all her drama because you have no choice. You have to, because you can't get another girl like her. And this is precisely why, gentlemen, that you never want to enter a relationship with a woman unless you already know how to get girls in the first place, unless you already know how to get a new girlfriend anywhere, anytime with relative ease and do it quickly. So go to attractionzilla.com to learn how to get coaching with me so you can have more options in your life. Now the thing is, everything that I've told you so far doesn't matter if the girl has a big ego. If the girl has a big ego, you might just have to knock her down a peg or two and bring her down to earth first. So watch this video next. How to destroy a hot girl's oversized big ego.
And this is especially true of really beautiful women. They're just used to getting a lot of male attention and are spoiled brats. So go watch it right now.